Welcome back everybody to another Halloween season of Go Goes Crazy Bones, the McDonald's edition. If you guys have been here on the channel for the past few years, you would know that every year I've been opening up some McDonald's packs of the Go Goes Crazy Bones Halloween special series, and I've been opening up the Go Goes Crazy Bones ghost series. Well, I got myself more of the Mickey D's and it is time to open up and discover if we're going to get tricked or treated this year to some truly incredible finds and pulls of this one of a kind McDonald's Happy Meal toy. We've already gotten quite a few up here of some of the McDonald's ones. Lots of the golds, lots of the glow in the darks. I've got more below in storage too, but I absolutely have a blast with these. Hopefully you guys too. If you do enjoy this video, make sure to leave a like, subscribe to the channel, and don't miss that ghost video coming out at the end of the month on Halloween. Let's go open up some spooky McDonald's Go Go's Crazy Bones. All right, the McDonald's Halloween set of Go Go's Crazy Bones. We've got all 12 of them over here sitting off to the side. We've got them all. We got Funny Bone. We've got two of number one somehow. How did that happen? Okay, we've got double of these. Interesting. Maybe we'll open up a second one of Funny Bone and Howler. But I think we are going to start with number one. Or maybe, you know what? We'll just grab bag it. We're going to go random this year. We're going to switch it up a little bit. Just go for any type of pick. In fact, you know what? I want to do Menace first. He's one of my favorites from the series. So we're going to open him first. Let's clear the board and get out our good old Menace and Boo. Great, great pack. Number five. Let's see what we got. Can we open these by hand? Hopefully all of them are that easy. We've got Menace in a crazy looking royal purple. Oh my goodness. He's pretty sick. That is a deep, deep purple. Dang, almost metally purple too, actually. Kind of wild looking. We do got our little card here for webs. Very nice. We've seen those plenty of times. So I think we're going to go to a glittery gold boo. That looks super fantastic. I mean, come on. That looks sick. What a wonderful little grab for boo. That looks absolutely great. I don't believe I have a gold glitter of boo yet. I've got another translucent of him, but not a glitter gold. I'll take that. Number two is what I just grabbed randomly next. We got Sweetie and Webb. Sure, we'll get a just whatever one out of the way. Not my favorite. Sweetie, not my favorite character. That's all right. That's okay. Let's get the card out first. Eh, I can't really grab it. We'll get Sweetie out. We've got a metally kind of gray. It's got that little sleek shine going on to it here a little bit, but it's not a metal. It's just a silver and that's okay. It's still pretty clean looking as far as like grays go, I guess. I don't know. Maybe I'll paint that one or something. This card is uh, sticking quite a bit. We do get our little, what is this? Scholarship little fun thing here. We can get it, maybe get something good out of that. We got wow for the card. And then for webs, who do we have? We've got just a nice base purple. This is a cleaner purple. I think I prefer this over this dark, dark purple, but you can kind of see that comparison here is pretty wild looking. All right, since we have doubles of number one, we'll just go to number one and we will see who we got in here. We've got funny bone and howler. Here is funny bone in a hot, hot pink. A very cool classic hot, hot pink. Very nice. Very, very cool. He looks, the mold on this one looks great, actually. Very, very clean on this one. Put you over there. We'll get the card out. I am feeling plastic, so we may have gotten lucky, boys. Let's get it. We got Haggy. And who do we got for, for well, I forgot who we were on. We did Funny Bone Howler. Let's see it. A ba ba bing ba ba boom. Uh, that is a professional grade gold go go from the Mickey D's toy run of Howler, one of my faves. That looks amazing, absolutely stunning. Let's get him out of the bag. We're not. I'm not going to keep him in the bag. He's he's going to be in perfect condition. Oh, just look at that shiner. Oh my goodness me. That is wonderful. You can see it like my reflection going on in there too in the eyes. Hey y'all. Super, super nice. I mean, crystal clear. No fingerprints. Hasn't been opened in like 20 years. 
and it is in pristine mint condition. That is a beautiful, beautiful pull. Oh my gosh, let's get more of those. That is fantastic. Gotta follow up with that somehow. I don't know how. We got Wow and Rascal. We love the skull in this one. He's super nice. I would love just like a small version of Rascal, I think would be super cool. It'd be so fun to like have them bring back the classic McDonald's set, maybe up it a little bit with some more monsters and then like make them the actual go-go size. We got Tut for the card wrapped in plastic. Let's see who we got for, wow, woo, that neon yellow. Holy crap, blinded by the light. That is a crazy, crazy neon yellow. He looks really, really nice actually. I don't have a lot of these super extreme bright colors, so I will gladly take you. That is excellent. Rascal, give me a good color of Rascal. Who do we got? We've got the base purple, pretty common color, I would say for the Halloween set. I do believe I've got a couple of him in this kind of base purple. That's okay, they can't all be winners, but I love my Rascals. They look so cool. Number 11, Top Hat and Doc. All right, Top Hat and Doc. Doc is pretty nice from this set. Top Hat is just, meh, you know, whatever on that one, but that's okay. We got Chef here for the card. Who do we got first? We're gonna try to pull out Top Hat. Nope, Doc is coming out first. We got this nice, metally, creepy looking black. Very, very cool. It's They're super clean on the black ones, honestly. That mold really comes through and hits the light like really, really nicely. So that's not bad. That's not a bad one to get, I would say. Top Hat, on the other hand, is going to be, ooh, We've got a nice teal, a very, very nice teal. That is really cool as well. Awesome looking color, another bright one. I love the bright takes, that is great. We're going down to the lower numbers with number three, Cool Dude and Haggy. Haggy is the witch character. Cool Dude is just whatevs. We got another WoW card, no big deal there. Let's pull out this boy. Oh, we've got a tie-dyed boy. Wow, very similar to one I already have. It's this green and purple mix of the tie-dye. You can see it shining through there. Pretty cool. I love getting these tie-dyed ones. They're really nice. And he is a very flat boy. Like he is very, very flat. Kind of crazy. I think some of the other ones I have of him have a bigger, wider base than this guy does. It's very crazy that he's so so curved. You can put your whole thumb in there. No big deal. Interesting, but a great tie-dye pull. Haggy, what do you got for us? We've got the classic little Halloween, but this orange is actually a little bit different. This is like a metal orange. I don't think I've ever seen this type of orange. I don't know if the camera's going to pick up on that either, but this is very much like that same kind of metal as this purple one. Now I have oranges but not like this. This is crazy looking. That is a really, really unique colorway for this McDonald's toy. That is, that is really cool. Never have I seen this metal orange. That is really neat. Tell me in the comments below if you guys have any of these, do you have this kind of metally orange flavoring? That is really cool. We are gonna go back up to number 12. We got Smiley and Lucky. We are gonna get the card of Sweetie out of the way. And we are gonna get smi oh no, we're gonna get lucky. And oh my gosh, it is lucky today because holy crap, we just got another one of those orange medallies. That is so sweet. A great looking Halloween orange lucky and in that metal vibe. That is really, really unique, really, really cool. Great one, another great one. That's super, super dope. Smiley, what do we got for you here? We've got, oh, an incredible, holy juicy tie-dyed blue Batman. Holy frick, that's an incredible tie-dye. That is a stunning little toothpaste tie-dye. That is crazy cool. I mean, the back looks pretty good for sure, but that front end is wild and that is so so nice this is definitely going up on display this has got to be a top pick for me for sure for these mcdonald's toys that is a really really dope one holy cow where are we gonna start putting these up on the pumpkins i guess so we are gonna go in to number six next we're getting goody goody and tut out of the way tut is a nice one uh, we got, he's got like haggy vibes a little bit. Oh, this one's not going to open very nicely. Oh, come on. We were doing so good this whole time. All right, we got it. We got it from the bottom. Let's see. Can we get the card out first? 
We've got Boo for the card. I don't think I have a lot of Boo for the cards, actually. Get a lot of the other ones. Who are we pulling out first here? Oh, goody, goody is giving us the treats for Halloween. We've got a glow in the dark, goody, goody. That is awesome. Fantastic. Let's get the light out here so you can kind of see the glow. Can we give it a little shine, a little shimmer? You can kind of see it a little bit. You can get the glow on it. It is glowing. It's just really bright in here. But dang, that is a nice glow in the dark, goody, goody. A nice looking mold too, actually. Not too wild. It's very like more compacted, more squished, I guess. I don't know. I've seen wilder goody, goody molds, I guess I would say. But let's get Tut out here. Ho, 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 ho. We have another winner with this glitter gold of Tut translucently. That is amazing. Holy crap. You can, it looks like the mouth is like completely empty. You could like just reach inside of it. These packs have been treating us well. What a great, great McDonald's goodie bags here. These are some just stellar, stellar hits. I always love doing these. There's a reason why I've done this, what, like now three, four years in a row? What is this, number four that I've opened up the entire set? I love these guys. They're always so much fun. All right, Chef Drax, this is number seven. Let's get them out, see what we've got going on. We've got webs for the card. We've got an amazing looking lime green for Drac. That is sick. Oh, he's got the lighting going on under there. That looks very, very nice. I love it. Gotta love the green, bright colors. We're gonna just set you. Can you stay? Can you stay? He's gonna stay. All right. And for Chef, we've got another green, but just kind of the basic green. No big deal here. Uh, this one, I have a few of this type of green. He does look good if it comes more in this tie-dye looking thing, but just a normal one, no big deal. Looks fine, looks fine. All right, we got number nine, Music and Scrappy Boy over here. Let's get him out. Oh, we got another tough one to open. Come on. Okay, we, we got it, we got it. All right, Music. Okay, little tie-dyed flare on the bottom, but it kind of looks like a gross little toothpaste tie-dyed. There's like a little chip right here, and then the toothpaste area kind of just makes, look, makes it look like it's cracked. Kind of interesting. Again, this is kind of like that base green that I was talking about. No big deal here. Not, not too crazy. The toothpaste isn't even that impressive. Uh, we've got for the card, we've got Sweetie, no biggie, and... There he is. Look at that boy. Oh, another nice black of scraps. That is cool. Very, very creepy in that lighting. Oh boy, our favorite little go go scarecrow. Why haven't they done more scarecrows? Scarecrows are dope in go go crazy bones versions. This is really cool. Another good black one. It'd be cool to get the whole set of black. You guys know that we are definitely saving number four for the end, right? That's got our eggy and our punky in it. We've got number 10 left, Speedy and Fangs. And we do have that number one duplicate for some reason. I don't know. We're going to see if we're going to open that up. But we're going to start with number 10. We're going to go from there. We're going to get a Menace card out of the way. Very nice. We've got Speedy in a very sharp Cerulean Royal Blue. Another really cool blue that I do not really have. No tie-dyes around him, but he is clean looking. Very clean very nice blue, very nice coloring. He's gonna go up there somehow. And Fangs, our little bat boy, we've got that metally purple going on. Very, very sharp. Nice metally purple, but not super dark. It's kind of a lighter metal purple. I dig it, I dig it. I love this bat. He's super, super sick. Pretty good pull, pretty good pull. All right, the moment that we've all been waiting for, we've got number four, the classic Eggy and Punky pack. Will we get something good? I don't know. Hopefully we can find something neat. I would love like a translucent Eggy would be phenomenal to finish this, this video off because holy crap, we've been getting some good ones. Menace card, let's avoid the Eggy. All right, that one's Eggy. We need to get Funky out first. Funky is a nice little purple. Am I saying funky or punky? It's punky. I keep saying funky, but we got kind of this a lighter purple. Again, another tone of purple. We've gotten like four different tones of purple in this video alone. Pretty wild. You can see there's a little smooching of green trying to inch its way in in a nice toothpaste tie-dye, but it didn't quite work. It just looks a little gross. 
and Barfy. Uh, but that's okay. They can't all be winners in that regard. Let's get Eggy out. Give me something good. Eggy. Oh, it's just a normal gray with one little streak of pink running through his base. Oh, it's got a little bit more, actually. It's got a little bit. Okay, okay. It's got a little nice swirl of pink tie-dye in there. Can you imagine getting like a crazy good tie-dye of this one with that hot pink running through it? That would be really cool. There's some more on like the shoulder, back, butt area, but that's kind of about it. Just a little flare of pink. But overall, just like a basic gray eggy, nothing too crazy, but we love our eggy, so, you know, it is what it is. Well, frick it. I mean, we have an extra duplicate of number one, so I guess we're just going to open up this one and see what we get. I don't know. I, I usually order myself online. I get the whole set somehow from some kind of deal over the next year for the next time I do a video. Uh, and somehow along the way, I must have just got a duplicate. I don't, don't really know how that worked out. But we'll open it. We'll see what we can find. And we've got a card of Lucky. Well, let's see. We've got one of the scholarship things. And we're going to get out. Oh, who do we, who we got right here? We got, oh, Funny Bone in a, again, another like reddish purple, like a magenta color. Very, very nice. Another one that I just don't see a lot. We've gotten two really kind of unique funny bone colors. That's fun, I like that. Okay, and for Howler, what will it be? We've got a glowy to finish us out. A glowy Howler, let's get it. Let's go. Glow in the dark Howler to end the video. Can't ask for better than that, man. That is fantastic. I am working my way to a full set of the glow in the darks for these guys. Incredible. Incredible find, incredible video, incredible polls. I mean, this this is great. All treats, no tricks. Perfect. Let me know in the comments which one was your favorite poll that we got today. Obviously, I think I'm a little biased towards the Gold Howler. And I think I would have to go, of course, with our tie-dye man. He just looks absolutely stunning. But that's just my opinion. You tell me what your favorite was in the comments down below. And guys, stay tuned. You know what we do every year around Halloween. We open up the McDonald's and then we close out the month of October and the spooky season with the classic Go Go's Crazy Bones ghost set. I love this series. It's amazing. And I'll tell you what, I bought a crap ton of these packs like three years ago, and this is the last of them. I've got 15 packs left, and then I'm out of packs for Crazy Bones Ghosts. It's crazy. It's wild. I made them last throughout the years to make videos, and this will probably be one of the last ghost videos unless I find another crazy good deal for a bunch more, but... You know what? These things can get pretty pricey. So you're not going to want to miss this final video of GoGo's Crazy Bones Ghosts, the opening, the pack cracking, the spookiness. That's going to do it for the video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that one. Again, if you did, leave a like, subscribe, and don't miss the final video of October, the GoGo's Crazy Bones Ghost Edition pack cracking. Can't wait to get into the final packs that I have for ghosts. It's going to be sad, but it's going to be a blast. So join me there. Enjoy your weekend, and we will catch you guys in the next video.